In this video, you will learn the best export settings for Facebook. Let's get started. My friends, my family, and everyone else in between, welcome back to a channel that teaches you how to explore, inspire, and engage as an active videographer. My name is Cody Scott, and if you're new to this channel, please feel free to consider hitting that like button, subscribe to support, or hit that dislike button if that's something you're into, but you don't have to. Before we jump into the best export settings for Facebook, you first must understand two things. What is a codec and target platform? A codec is the level of compression that you apply to your video. And that is important to know because H.264 is a level of compression. And this level of compression is what we will be applying to our video today to get the best export settings for Facebook. The target platform is important to understand because your video may not be ending up on social media. If it is for television, it is a different codec to present to your client. So let's jump into Final Cut Pro X and get started. We are now in Final Cut Pro X, and there are two ways to export your video with the best export settings for Facebook. The first way is the automatic shortcut that is provided by Final Cut Pro X that will allow you to just simply click on the preset Title your project, click on settings, choose the highest resolution possible, change this from faster encoder to better quality, and then click next. If you do not have that export setting, don't worry, because you can click into your export settings, scroll down to add destination, and then simply just move the option that you would like over to the section with the rest of your export settings. It automatically saves so when you can come back up to your export settings, you'll be able to simply click on it, title your project, and you're good to go. The second way to export your video with settings that are the best for Facebook requires some manual custom settings. Go back up to your export square, click on master file, title your project, and then click on settings. You have options under format. And the best export setting for Facebook is when you click video and audio. A quick note, if you're delivering to a client that is commercial, more than likely you will want to deliver both MOV and MP4 formats to them. Click on video and audio, scroll down to computer and notice that your format changes from MP4 to MOV. If they're using it for their website, click on web hosting change the quality to the highest, better quality, and you're good to go. We will be using the video and audio option. Next, change the video codec. Scroll down and click on H.264. If you would like to change the resolution of your project, you'll have to go to your media browser, click on your project, go to modify, and change the resolution by clicking under the section of video and changing your resolution as needed. The best export settings for Facebook are the following. Go up to your media section, click master file, title your project, scroll over to settings, change the codec to H.264, click next and you're good to go. Now if you're uploading to Instagram, TikTok, YouTube, Facebook, or any other social media platform besides LinkedIn, you will want to use H.264 at the highest resolution possible. H.264 will allow for the smoothest playback when they're watching your video on the internet. Now, if you're uploading to LinkedIn, the best format to use is an MP4 format. When you're delivering to television clients, you will need to use an MP4 format. If you found this video helpful, you can support the growth of this channel by clicking subscribe. You can like this video if it was helpful to you, or you can click that dislike button if that's something that you're into. That's all for me. So until next time, I'll see you in the next one.